Dolphins Breeze is Chris Edwards filling in for uh, Rob today. It's 10 past 8. Michael Jackson, the way you make me feel. So we just got a bit of an update on Rob. We just talked to him. He was in with the doctor signing consent forms. I'm not quite sure. He's probably explaining what he actually did to his finger. The, uh, either the can of peaches or putting in something up. You know, DIY is not a thing. I'm, I'm still convinced that his injury is a, is a, a you know, domestic chore. Well, we will find yeah. out because we will chat to him. But he's okay, though. Bus he is. Oh, now, the Auckland yeah. International Buses Festival kicks off today, runs right through the long weekend until Monday down at the viaduct, along the waterfront, various other spots around the CBD. Joining us now is a fellow who's going to be right amongst it all. They call him Snap Mooey. Bam, bam. <laughs> yeah. Hello. Welcome to Auckland. What's up? How, how y'all doing? How did your name come about? Because it's clearly not your action name. Uh, your, uh, my name is actually, it came because I was in a dance group called the Floor Lords Crew and they gave me the name because my uncle, he was a break dancer before, uh -huh. and then he, they passed the name down to him because he, he passed away, and then I, they found out that I was one of the, I was, I was his um, nephew. So that's an honor. Yeah, Isn't it's an it? honor. Yeah, oh, <laughs> I man. like it. It really is. And so busking is the wider term for so many different performance acts. You're, you're a yeah. dancer. Are you mostly a dancer? I'm a dancer. I'm, yeah. I, I'm what you call a popper. Uh, pop. A lot of people uh, see it. They, they, they call it pop and lock, but. It's like popping, like, you know, you do like the robot and all that kind of stuff. Okay, I'm but 45, I, I've never popped. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you can do it, though. <laughs> and, and I do, I, I add, like, the, on my bad, I, I add the elements of tap dancing and break dancing in my show. I've, really? I yeah. have watched wow. you because what I watched was your audition for America's Got Talent. Which yeah. Is like, 2011? Was yeah, it? 2011. Yeah, and you made it through to the top 12. Yeah, that's right. That's a phenomenal achievement. Maybe. Yeah. How, did, how has that shaped your life since? Um, well, I've been traveling the world. This is my first time in New Zealand. Um, I got, I, you know, I, was, I got out the, the ghetto, the hood, yeah. um, and I, you know, I've done a movie so far. I'm actually working on some new, some stuff coming up. I'm not really supposed to talk about it, but uh, it's just been shaping me. Like it's putting me in the right path. That way, I don't have, you know. That way I can take myself to the next level, you know? Yeah, because we were watching uh, your audition for that show and you talked about being a street performer mm -hmm. at, at the time so that you could help pay your mum's bills. Yeah. And you also talked about relatives who'd been in prison and were in prison at the time. Uh -huh. And, and they were, you know, you had you had your struggles, eh? Yeah, we, we still have struggles, but it's like, it's an ongoing thing and it's, it's just life, you know? Uh, I, I like, I personally find like street performing as like a, as, as an escape from just like regular lifestyle and all that kind of stuff. So it's cool, man, you know? And how is your mum these days? You still, you still help great. her out? And, yeah. yeah, well actually, um, she, she actually helps herself out now. She's an interpreter. She speaks diff six different languages. And uh, yeah, <laughs> it's, it's that's why- my mum. Yeah, that's <laughs> uh, I, I actually speak a few different languages because of my mom's influence. So I speak Japanese and I speak French and um, my, my, my girlfriend right now, she's she's the French girl from Canadian, so je parle avec her, you know? Well, uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, you speak with her. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Did you always have a plan as a, as a kid um, to kind of, to, to, to try and break out of those struggles and was dance always a way that you sort of thought yeah, you might be able to do that? Pretty much. I, I mean, I fell in love with dancing as soon as I saw it. Saw it. Uh, the, I used, my mom put me in these, like the scholarship program. I, I was able to get into it scholarship program to learn ballet and tap dancing and all that kind of stuff but I didn't really like it because you know like my like it just was very feminine and I like to be a man and yeah. I, I have nothing wrong I, <laughs> there's nothing wrong with being like no. being in touch Embracing and, the feminine yeah side. but I just it's I, not you. yeah it just yeah. wasn't me you know so I like I, I, I like um break dancing I like I do like Michael Jackson. Man. Yo, Michael Jackson is a man right now. I like Michael Jackson, Prince. Um, I'm a lot into like hip hop, um, but really like some of the some of the people who I like is Prince, Michael Jackson. Uh, oh, who I wish Robert yeah. was here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, his favorites as well. Especially I'd Prince. make him dance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you would. Is this as far a field as busking has ever taken you? Huh? Is this as far as a field as you've come? with your busking in terms of coming to New Zealand? You're on the other side of the world pretty much. Yeah, I'm pretty much. I mean, I've been to Australia. I've been I've been all over to, um, I've been all over Europe. I've been to Japan. Wow, um, that is awesome. Yeah, I can't, I, it's, I don't know. Everywhere is just different. You and know? and where can we find you this weekend? In a certain spot? Or will you be all over the place? I'll be all over at the okay. busking festival. Right. I, I can't right. wait to see you guys there. 
Yeah, well, wow. thanks for coming. You're yeah. open. You're loving here. Yeah. Thanks, man. Indeed. All the best. I appreciate it. All right, Snack Boogie. Thanks for welcoming. the Auckland International Buskers Festival this weekend. 16 past 8, you're listening to The Breeze. Bam, bam. <laughs>